Welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 2, where we last left off, we were underneath this dragon that causes my mother to come into my dreams, although, actually it causes a really creepy eyeball to come into my dreams. So either my mother is a really creepy eyeball, or something didn't work right. The eyeball, if you'll remember, was at the very beginning, and it was telling me to praise God, which I don't know why it was telling me, because I'm apparently the preacher's son. But that's okay. And it got really quiet. So don't turn your sound up. No, there's nothing wrong with my settings. It's just there's no sound right now. Here, I'll prove it. I can go into the menu, and there's sound. But out here, there's no background music. On the plus side, we did get color now. And I've got a little sprout on the top of my head. It looks like there's like a blue candle hovering around me, but I think that's my hair. Which is kind of cool. I've got a cowlick in real life, too, so bonus. Hi, guy. I haven't seen you around here before. Where are you from, boy? Okay. Um, I was here ten minutes ago. This guy has Alzheimer's. What about you? What? You live in this village? That's strange. I've always lived here, but I've never seen you. Um, why does no one remember me? Maybe this guy does have Alzheimer's. He's old enough to... I don't know. Whoa! What are you doing? You're a thief! Go away! Shoot! Wow. Here's a tip for you guys at home. If someone's trying to steal from you, don't just tell them to leave. Call the police or something. Do not use this guy's tactic. So nobody remembers me for some reason. Huh. Well, hey, if no one remembers me, maybe they'll let me outside without an adult, huh? Are you an orphan? If you have nowhere to go, go to the church. St. Ava will not turn you away. Who is this St. Ava person? I don't know her. Does she know me? Who is this child? Strange kid. Give me the creeps. Well, nobody knows me, but apparently they want me to go to the church. And you are not my dad. Who are you? Your father, Hulk. Hulk smash! Young child, welcome to the house of St. Ava. You also have no family, but you have nothing to fear. The church will never turn away a poor child like you. I can't really do him with a Hulk voice. Hulk doesn't ever talk this much, so I apologize. It was funny at first, but then he just kept going. So I won't talk to him anymore. Even if you are a thief. There, think of this as your own home. And it is my own home. What are you talking about? Wait, and apparently I look like a thief. I don't know why. I think I look pretty nice. I'm a little, like, candle-headed kid. I'm not a thief. Meanies. Heave ho! Oh, hey, there's another guy here. Hi, guy. You have flappy ears. What a cheap place. I guess I'll take the candles. Hi! You don't have to say anything. You're just like me, right? Actually, that's nice I don't want to say anything, because I don't think I can talk. I'm not entirely sure. You act like a poor child, get into the church, and you steal any valuables you can find, right? But this place is worthless. We have to go to a bigger village. I'm going to another village. Are you going to stay here? Yeah, I'm going to stay here. This is my home. What? Are you saying that stealing is bad? <laughs> Damn right. Orphans like us have to do anything we can to survive. I'm not an orphan. My mom and dad... Well, my sister and dad just got eaten by an eyeball in my dream. Well, I sound insane. God will forgive us for such a small thing as stealing. But if you don't want to come, I'm not going to insist. You can live in this little village quietly. And pray to God. Praise God. You'll become God's strength. Ooh, wait a minute. Ominous music says I shouldn't stay here. So, no, I'm not staying here. I'm coming with you, guy. Haha, <laughs> I thought you would. Whoa, he's good. You don't want to live in an old village like this, right? Besides, bad guys like us don't belong in a church, right? Wait, bad guys like us snuck into the church of our own free will. What do you mean we don't belong here? I mean, tell you, my name is Bo. Actually, my name is Bao, because I'm a dog. Nice to meet you. Bao has joined our group. Yes, this is actually kind of cool. This was one of the first games that I can remember that did this. Granted, this was my first game ever, so I don't know how much that actually matters. But you don't just collapse into one guy, you actually follow each other around. And you change position. If you press... Well, somehow you can change the position. There is a way to change your order. I don't know if... Maybe you can't do it yet. Maybe not as a kid. Oh, I talked to him again. Dear God, he's sleeping. Why is he sleeping there? You've got a bed over here, you crazy old man. 
Ugh, crazy people. Okay. So we are sneaking out of town. All right, and the sentry is gone. All the monsters can come in here all they want. We are getting out of here. Getting out of here, getting out of Dodge. Everybody likes walking the... Uh, wait, what? Oh, oh, oh no. It looks like rain. Well, crap, it really does look like rain. Wow, here comes the rain. It's pouring. Can we find a place to get out of the rain? We can. We'll just leave tomorrow, right? What's the sense in going back to the village? Uh, to get out of the rain? Okay, fine. We'll go this way and get out of the rain. Yeah, I'm, I'm traveling with a smelly dog now. Because he's wet and he stanks. This is not a very good way to start off as a hero. Man, it smells. Hey, it's pitch black in here. Oh, the candle. I can use that candle. We're set. Let's go. I don't know how confident I am spelunking with a candle. Get a torch or something. Oh, oh crap. What the hell was that? What was that? I just asked that. Let, let's follow it? Are you serious? Are you out of your mind? No, let's not follow it. I'm going back to the village. Hey, hey, wh where are you going? It's probably yep. Yeah, but there's a freaking monster in here. <sighs> okay, fine. We'll follow the monster. If this gets us killed, I am blaming you, game designers. Wait. Oh, hey, we can go this way. No, we can't. No, no that's not the way. The hell it isn't. Okay, you're the chosen one, or something. You were a god's strength. You're the hero of an RPG. You can fight with some little monster. Even though you couldn't find a blue-headed thing earlier. Surely this creature is less powerful than a blue-headed thingy. Oh, crap. Uh, oh, it's a monster! How did that big thing get through that tunnel? Its head is way too big to fit. Oh, well. Smack! That's what you get. And there I go being brave again. Are you saying you are the one? You say that you are the child for the mission? All right then, prove it to me. Um, kill it. I did not kill it. Damn, this is your fault, pal. Go ahead, Tyfe. Let me see you open the gate, destined child. And that is when you will know the strength of God. I thought I was God's strength. I am the strength of God. And I will con- whatever. It was like waking from a long dream. But now his father and sister had disappeared and no one else recognizes him. He dreamt of a monster demon. Of a horrific demon even. Wow, how'd I do that? Who ripped his heart and body apart. But it remains just a dream. That was one hell of a dream. I will tell you that right now. Oh, here's another pillar. Yet, the vision remains strong. Deep within the corners of his mind, he hears it calling. A different world. A world of silence. A world of darkness. He moves towards it, feeling both fear and exhilaration. He succumbs, and the darkness welcomes him. You are the one! The demon screeches. Reaching deep within his own heart, he realizes that it is true. Then, in that moment, reality washes away and the dream begins to take shape. Oh, this is the pillar that connects, or that holds up the world. Uh-oh, here's title music. We're going back. Back to the beginning of the series, when we started the new game. And actually, we're also ending this video. So, next time, we're going to go ahead and enter the game proper, because we're back to the title. So, I will see you at when we are all grown up as an adult. See you next time!